All right, thanks, Jay. As people head outside to enjoy the warmer temperatures, doctors want to remind people to make sure your little ones are protected from the sun. Kelloland's Renee Ortiz reports. The shining sun means it's time for warmer weather, outside activities, and of course, time to get sunscreen. Rachel Hackle and her daughter Jay Lynn pulled out their bottles from last year, only to find out they were expired. This nice weather kind of snuck up on me and uh, went to grab it out and couldn't use any of it really. Once it gets expired, it just isn't guaranteed to have that same SPF protection that's written on the bottle. Pediatrician Jennifer Hager recommends a 50 SPF mineral-based sunscreen for children six months and older. When children get too much sun exposure, or sun damage, or sun burns, it really increases their adult risk of skin cancer. If your child is under six months, there are other ways to keep them safe from the sun. We typically recommend using physical barriers to protect them from the sun. So that's sun protective clothing, that's keeping them in the shade, that's using umbrellas or their other devices like their stroller or their car seat to just keep them out of the direct sunlight. Sienna Whitmore and her one-year-old son Torin are out enjoying the weather. This is our first summer really being able to like do parks and everything and really enjoy them and explore. She says it's important to be prepared when heading outside. A good mineral-based sunscreen, um, cute little hats, uh, limiting the amount of exposure, kind of easing our way into things. Important advice for protecting your skin while enjoying the outdoors. In Sioux Falls, Renee Ortiz, Kelloland News. They picked a good park. We've already been there a few times this warmer weather week. Uh, they say it's a good choice for sunscreen to have active ingredients of zinc or titanium. You can find labels for ingredients and expiration dates on the bottles of the sunscreen.